Hello and welcome back to Transport Fever. Um, last time out we built we built this, we did the connection here, we managed to get this bit in here. We did a fair bunch of stuff and I did ask in the comment section whether you wanted to see uh, a particular bridge over here. I did also ask about the passenger station, got nothing about the passenger station so yeah. Anyone want a passenger station here? I don't know. I really don't know. That's not very American in how it looks but that's okay, it really doesn't matter. Anyway, it seems like you guys really, really wanted to see the bridge. So, in this episode, I am going to be trying to build this overpass bridge that will probably start somewhere here, go across here and connect up on this side so that trains don't have to stop, freight trains will not have to stop here. And if we do have passenger trains that aren't stopping at a station here, they'll just be able to pass through and pass over as well. So let's get straight on with it. Um, before, we, before we also continue, I'm going to say, a uh, bit cheeky, but I think I've go I'm going to have to say this because um, it's kind of important to me as a YouTuber as I start planning this up. Please do remember, if you do like this video, um, after you've watched the video, of course, don't, don't just, well, I suppose you could hit it now, but do hit that like button if you do like the video and make sure you do leave comments in the comments box because it's those comments and those likes that essentially give me the viewing on YouTube and give me the give me the actual idea as to what you guys want to see and where to take the series so they are really really important let's smooth this out um, yeah those are very very important more important than you guys probably w would think of them actually being but uh, yeah especially the likes the because the, re the reason being is that with YouTube, with the algorithms, sometimes they, they result, you know, they, they want to see what videos are getting likes and those are the videos they'll, they'll uh, show up in searches and stuff like that and, you know, that, that kind of makes it quite uh, important. Uh, that's all smooth, oh, not that bit there. So that's why, that's why we ask for these things. Um, not because we're, not because we think our videos are always incredible and all that kind of stuff. I mean, we try and make the best videos we can. I'm sure all YouTubers uh, who are doing this professionally are trying to make the best videos they possibly can. Uh, but, you know, it's it's your guys' support that always, always helps us out. Now, if you're wondering why I'm smoothing this, uh, because of the whole bridge that's going to be going in, I want to smooth this one side down uh, somewhat because I think this is going to, it's going to be important to have this smooth down that's a bit better okay good right, let's just smooth this entire area a little there we go that's that all smoothed in or smoothed up and on the other side what's it like on the opposite side the opposite side looks fairly good to me it's a little bit here no that looks that looks good enough to me right let's get this bridge and this bridge idea underway and done so I'm thinking if it is possible, and I don't think it's going to be, but we're going to give it a go. If I was to run something straight out of here. No, construction not possible. Okay, let's try. I mean, we're going to be, let's say, running two tracks. Let's put the two tracks like this. There. Okay. And let's see how these tracks want to join up. Not too well. Alright, what about from this side? Do they want to join up? Okay, it'll join up to that one in, in that long, rounded fashion that I want it to. But it won't. You know what? Let's go from the second. Oh, no, it still doesn't. I really want to get it off the second one. Where would it want to go? It wouldn't want to go on any of those because of the terrain alignment collision. Now, I'm not sure why it's colliding with this section here, is it? So, they're two small sections. So, if I turn that into one big section, will it be happier to cross it? I'm hoping it will then be happier to cross. No, still not. Hmm. 
but it's happy to go across all the way. It's a bit silly. I mean, essentially, what I could do is I can make it go all the way, slip that junction, slip that junction. Should we do that? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Um, so I'm going to do that. Then we're going to uh, slip that junction and slip that one. Okay, so that means that this one can go that way, that one can go that way. And then we're just going to demolish this side of it. Oh no! Oh, it won't let us do that. Well, that's just rubbish. So this is going to be the tough part of today's episode. I, I immediately after getting the comments saying that, and thank you guys for the comments because that's, like I said, uh, that's really, really important. But immediately after getting the comments for that, I was like, oh, I kind of regret this already. Um, right, that's kind of... I want a really high speed. thing is do we really need that high speed let's do that and then I'll okay this is going to be an issue because then it's not letting me get rid of these see that's not an acceptable junction to me oh, then I have to delete everything Unless, unless I did this, hold on. What if I bring that one back and then say, for example, from there, I will go straight up to that, like so. And from there, I also will run, no, maybe somehow, We used to be able to have longer junctions in these. We really did. But if I did that, and then did that, that doesn't look too bad. I mean that, so one slightly, it just goes out slightly wider than the other, but that allows the split onto this line. Similarly, if I was to run this in, well, actually, this one might just fit. I might just get this one fitting. Yeah, there we go. Well, that one's just a... Uh, that's just easy as pie. Okay. The question is, we went... F well, mm, no, that's okay. I was going to say, we went four... But where did we have the six? The six is way up here. So it's not really feasible for us to run six track all the way along there. Like people said, there's a lot of places that just have two track in America. Uh, but because of the nature of the map and the size and the scale of the, of the rail as opposed to the, sc uh, the scale of the actual terrain, I've got to make some, some sort of... Uh, Take some artistic freedom, I suppose. Right, so that goes like that. That goes like that. I would really be wanting this one to jump across as far as it can. There we go. So it's almost like a slip junction, but it's not really. I mean, I'm not sure if that would have been possible to slip. I don't think it would have. So, and then we'll do the same here. So as high speed as we can possibly get it. There we go. Like so. So that goes that way, that goes that way, that goes that way. That's okay. So we've done that section. It's only taken us, what, nine minutes? Okay, now. Essentially, we should... I should let this just go uphill, really, from here. I think that, that's going to be the smart thing to do. Because we've got the hill. So if we just let it go uphill. 
We can. I want it to run. I suppose a straight run. But. Mm, mm, it's a bit early for it to do that. So we'll, we'll have it going up. Let's see where, it, where it's headed. Yeah, it's still going to be further up if I do that. Yeah, I suppose that could look okay. Or we could run it at whatever level it's going to be till about here and then start lifting it. Actually, I might do that, so let's, let's do that. So we're going to do that. So you can clearly see that that's now gone up and then very, very slowly it's come back down. Which isn't exactly how I wanted it. But now we start swinging it around. And as we get to about this point here, we should now start using the, the lift on it. There we go. And there's the bridge. That's the bridge we're after. Should we just go for a wooden bridge? It's going to be really, really slow. And I think a stone bridge is the one we're after. Now, can we? No. Okay, come on. I want the. I want to get the bridge as quickly as possible. You see, if I could have the bridge all the way there, that would have been nice as well. But uh, we can't. But okay, we'll take that. And we've bridged up. And now comes the tough part. How high do we want this to go? I think that's actually high enough. No need to go any higher. We'll bring that right in. Like so. And then let's see if we can get a straight track all the way across. And that is straight track all the way across. Come on. That's almost perfect. In fact, at this rate, we could even four track this section. But I'm not going to four track it. Okay, okay, okay. That that's going to that's going to bring in a lot of nice, nicer uh, moments. Trains pulling into here, trains pulling into there, and then just you know. Although I don't know what I'm going to be really using this for. I suppose we can bring the wood in here. We can bring. Oh, well, then what am I going to be using this for? That's going to bring in iron from over there. It's probably going to bring in some lumber from over there. We could. Maybe easier to bring in lumber there, bring in food here, bring in oil here, bring in stone here, iron there. And we could probably bring in lumber from here as well and iron in from there. Or something of the sort. Okay, so now comes the tough part, and that's bringing it back down. Actually, that's not showing to be too tough at all. Apart from the fact that, you know, it's taking forever. Yeah, that, that might be an issue. Okay, uh, let's back this up just a little. Oops, sorry trees. Oops, took out some trees. Um, let's back this up just a little and we'll stop bringing it down. From well, I'll tell you what, no, 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 no. Instead of doing that, let's actually do the, you know, what we were going to do. Now on this side, I think it's it may work out easier. In fact, I think it is working out easier. That was just too easy. Of course, that's now following along with that. That's possibly why it was too easy. We want this to be 
Yeah, we want this to be like that. There we go. No, that's actually turned out far easier than the other side. Why was that so easy to do? And obviously, we need to do the second slips. In fact, can we possibly fit them in right here? No, not just yet. We probably need to extend the track a little bit. Okay, now, just out of curiosity, what would happen if I just tried to immediately connect it up to this? Do I even have to bother with anything else? That's... That's essentially perfect. Done. I'll take it. Thank you. I'll take that to the bank and I will cash it. Perfect. Okay, so that bridge, that bridge only took us uh, about 16 minutes to make. I must say, it's, it's a lot smoother up that side than it is on that side. Time to take a photo of it though. For a screenshot. Take it from here. There's your bridge. Whoever wanted the bridge. Who was it that first requested? Um, after I showed it. Simple C. Tony. Um, Marauder2003. I think I remember those three names. All going, yep, yep, yep. We want the bridge. So, in fact, I remember Marauder 2003. I remember you chanting, We want bridge, we want bridge, we want bridge. But, uh, there you go. There, there's, there's the bridge. That's not bad, right? Uh, we've got a few minutes left in this, so what we're going to do is let's start the extension over here so we can get the slip uh, onto, the other, onto the other line done. So, we just swing this. Now, we said we wanted to swing it back around that way so if we just bring up the uh, contour lines we are essentially clear all the way we're going to cut straight to the middle of this forest there we go like so and then from here we should be able to now do the super high speed as well as high speed as possible It looks like that's as high speed as we can get that one. And this one over here will go... Ooh, that's not going to be too high. Oh, well, actually, it's sort of the same speed. The lowest number is 66 miles per hour. There we go. So that's the pass, that's the pass through for the station. That's the station. That looks absolutely weird. Really weird. I was not expecting to ever have done that on this series. Uh, right. A couple of minutes to go. What do we need to do? Well, you know what? We need to start working out what's going to go out of here. Now, I'm thinking, I'm thinking we want to have some of these lines being terminal. So I was, I was going to say, if we just leave one, two, three, four lines as stop lines, right and then we'll do two four six eight ten twelve lines going out that should be okay so if we were to just and and we'll leave these on essentially level crossings so we'll even make them we'll even make them come right the way out like that and then swing them around if we really had to so we, we could swing them right over towards like indianapolis or wherever they need to go so we're going to be removing a fair whack of buildings but I think we should be okay. So let's just do that right now. Uh, so we will... Let, let's stop removing some buildings. And of course you guys may know that there's more, there's more to come from Transport Fever still. Um, I'm sure you guys have... If you've, if you've heard that uh, their modding contest is now closed. Uh, which is great. Speaking of mods, I need to release this map, don't I? Right, yeah, I need to do that. So, um, yeah, so their modding contest is now closed, and there are still performance updates and stuff that they want to be doing. Uh, so, you know, that's that's something that they're, they're still working on, which is great. 
Oh, that's actually going to work. I'm happy about that. I was not expecting that one to work. I could have just brought that in as well, but uh, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to see if I can... I'm going to see if I can bring this one across here. I don't think those are going to be in use, are they? Those end platforms, because of that road. That's okay. I'm going to end the video here, though. So thank you very much for watching. Uh, please remember to hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel for more videos on Transport Fever. Leave a comment in the comments box below. Let me know what you think of what I have done so far. If you like that bridge, please do let me know that you like that bridge. And if you didn't like that bridge, please do let me know that you didn't like that bridge. Next episode, we're probably going to be destroying that bit of road there. And we're going to see if we can hook up that side somehow over to this side in Naperville and then we've got to move from there down to St. Louis and then we've got to move this way we've still got this huge area to join up we've got lots and lots to do so do do subscribe for all of that and, and like I said uh, or if I didn't mention it do check me out on Patreon link to that is in the description box below your support would be massively appreciated and it'll just allow me to do more and more stuff for you guys make better better maps um better series and all that kind of stuff plus you'll get some behind the scenes access uh, outtakes blog posts all that kind of stuff just let you know just to get to know me a bit better get to know what i do a bit better and get to know why i do what i do uh thank you very much for watching once again and i will see you guys in the next episode of transport fever